Okay, so a lot of people don't know this about me and I didn't even know myself until recently I decided to check my Rocket League stats and that's when I discovered I went from champ all the way to SSL in only 4 months with about 700 hours. No boosting, nobody carried me and I didn't even have multiple accounts or anything like that. I did it all by myself. One account, solo queuing my way to SSL in threes and in this video i'm gonna be showing you what i did and how i was able to go from champ all the way to ssl in only four months first i should probably say how many hours i have in rocket league and the truth is i don't know i began playing back in 2016 all the way up until season one on playstation i would be playing mostly every day with my brother and we only had one ps4 so for many seasons we would be playing with split screen so yeah our ranks were low throughout many seasons mostly because we didn't really care about rank a lot and we just mainly played free play and private matches it wasn't even until season 9 when i first made champ in twos but after that our ranks stayed the same if not they went lower as you can tell in season 11 i only played twos and that's all and in season 12 i didn't even play at all i remember when free to play came out i decided to play a little bit more and i ended up diamond two and threes it wasn't even until the end of season two in march when i saw insane growth in my ranks like as you can tell from here in march one i was diamond two diff three in threes and by march 17 I was already GC2. That's crazy. It took me 16 days to go from Diamond 2 to Grand Champ 2. I know what you're thinking. This is insane. I'm probably making all this up and I know it, it seems crazy, but I'm actually not lying. A lot of you probably think this is my first video that I posted, but I actually posted another video in February when I was still on PS4 playing with a couple of my friends. And you can tell from that video, I was literally terrible. I unlisted the video, but as of today, I made the video public again, so feel free to watch it if you want. But disclaimer, it is very cringe. But the question is, how was I able to go from champ to SSL in only four months? It all happened so quickly, but I began searching for answers and just went through a crap ton of replays, seeing if I found anything. And after a couple days of researching, I came to the conclusion that these three reasons are probably how I was able to go from Champ 1 all the way to SSL in only 4 months. Reason number 1 is what I did with the amount of hours I have in Rocket League. Yeah, I know I said I didn't know exactly how many hours I have, and it's very hard to calculate how many hours you have on PS4. But I did some research and found this old reddit post that could help me calculate a rough estimate on how many hours I have in Rocket League. Judging by how many games I've played in hours, multiplying that number by 2.1 and also 0.175. And I got answers between 1600 and 1900 hours. But these are just estimated numbers from other players experiences. Unlike them, most of the time I would always be in free play training instead of actually playing rank. So if I had to take a calculated guess, I would say I have around 1000 hours in ranked games and 1800 hours mainly in free play. So in total I would say I have roughly about 2800 hours in Rocket League. So with that being said, there's no way I could have gotten so much better just because of the amount of hours I've, I've had in ranked matches. I must have done something in free play that dramatically increased my skills. And like I said earlier, me and my brother would usually always play in free play instead of playing any ranked matches. I spent lots of hours just in free play playing around. But the thing is, I never really watched any tutorials on YouTube or anything on how to improve in Rocket League. And I also never played a single custom training pack. And because of this, I didn't really know what to practice in free play. And I would just go around hitting the ball over and over again. I became really good at just reading the ball. Because I did this for many months, even years, I became very solid in the basics of Rocket League mechanics. But because I didn't play ranked a lot, my rotations were actually really really bad. So that would explain my very very low ranks. But the mechanics part, I was really good. So I was actually better than most people my ranked mechanically wise. Reason number two is switching from PlayStation 
to PC. This one actually makes sense. I played on PlayStation from 2016 all the way till the start of the new season 2 of Rocket League. And it wasn't until March when I finally got my PC. And if you look at the charts, starting from March, my ranks just instantly blew up. I mean, I'm not saying you should go buy a PC right now and waste all your money. But statistically, if you look at the statistics, I'm just saying. Anyways, obviously this isn't a major reason why I ranked up so fast, but it is a big part. Being able to just play with higher frame rates and also having less input lag really helped me out a lot. And also, most of you might be mad at me, but March was the month when I discovered how to use directional arrow left. Yeah, I know. I mean, it's not my fault. I never really watched tutorials or anything, so I literally had no idea I should have been using directional arrow since day one. But yeah, ever since I've had a PC, I've actually been playing Rocket League a lot more. And because of my basic mechanics and game sense were already really, really good, it wasn't hard to improve drastically in the game. Because I already knew how to do most of the stuff, it all came down to how many hours I put into the game to get more consistent with them. And I began watching more videos and began practicing in free play and my rank slowly went up and in July 9th is when I first achieved SSL. And lastly, reason number three is how I was able to change my play style. Because I have already been playing this game for many years, my mechanics and game sense didn't really need much more learning. The main thing I was suffering was my rotations and just knowing how to play threes. So I began watching so many RLCS videos, seeing how other pro players played. And the thing is, I would mostly watch Turbo Pulsa. I mean, he is a four time world champion, so there's like, there must be a reason why he was so consistent. I began learning his playstyle and just seeing why he went for plays and stuff like that. And because I was watching a lot of his gameplays and also played a lot of Rocket League, it was very easy to adapt to his, to his playstyle and just become so much better with rotations. And also, disclaimer, I did make SSL in 3s, which in my opinion is the easiest mode to SSL in, mostly because you have other teammates also, and most players that play 3s usually always try to be the mechanical or fast player in the team. So as long as they are decently good at the game and you are not making any mistakes, it's very easy to rank up in my opinion. Okay, so in conclusion, these are the three main reasons I think I was able to rank up so quickly in four months. I'm not saying doing these stuff will also help you reach SSL much faster because everybody has different play styles, but this is just my story on how I did it. And as you can tell, it did take a lot of grinding. It took me around 700 hours to get from champ one to SSL, and I currently have 900 hours on PC as of right now. And ever since the new season 4 came out, my ranks have actually gone down. Currently, I'm sitting at GC3 in 3s, and I'm not gonna lie, it's pretty hard to rank up right now because mostly I go against a lot of pro players. Like yesterday, I went against a full team of pro players for no reason, I don't know why. And of course, we lost. And take into consideration, because I'm SSL, I'm pretty decent at the game. But because I ranked up so quickly, I'm still adapting to the SSL playstyle. Like some games I would actually play really bad and my teammates would get mad at me and tell me how I even made SSL. And I would just reply with, I literally have no idea bro. And also I'm really bad at explaining stuff. So if you have any questions or have something to say, make sure to leave them down in the comments because I will try my best to answer as many questions. And also I, I'm also gonna leave a crap ton of links in the description just to show proof and where i got all the information from so yeah anyways thanks for watching the video sorry it was really long i just wanted to make sure to add more ads <laughs> no nah, i'm just kidding i wouldn't do that but yeah other than that um if you like the video make sure to subscribe leave a like if you want um and i was also thinking if it only took me four months to get to ssl i wonder how long it would take me to reach top 100 or maybe even become a pro.